Please don't stay there for me. Not with me, are they? The woman from the flower shop just dropped them off. Whatever. Chuck them. They're from Michael, aren't they? Tell me what it is for men. Why do you all have to lie and cheat to get what you want? <laughs> well, don't lump me in with the other losers in your life. Mm, believe me, you're all the same. Sounds like you've been talking to Katie. <sighs> See? Treat everything like a big joke. What? So? No one's perfect. What's he done anyway? <laughs> Nothing. What have you done with me stuff? What stuff would that be? Well, my clothes and shoes, for starters. Oh, over there. She's been in a strop all day. Worse than she got those. Katie! Katie! I can't stop. I'm on a mission. Layla needs black opaques and she needs them now. Look, about last night... Look, is that how you get your kicks, Ryan? Making me grovel and tell me I'm wasting my time? I behaved appallingly. You're telling me. <laughs> you should have never done the running, love. It gives them ideas above the station. As if men aren't deluded enough. <laughs> Look, let me, let me buy you a drink tonight and make up for it. Ryan, if you're that desperate female company, the small lad's in the back page <laughs> of the courier, yeah? One drink, come on. I get the message. Let's just leave it at that, OK? Uh, I'm free later, love, if you're uh, interested. Yeah, thanks, darling, but you're all right. Face it, loser. You blew it. Yeah, I don't want you back home. Yeah, my home's with you. Well, no. not anymore. But doesn't Sarah get a say? Sarah can make her own mind up when she's not a child and she's learnt about controlling men who bully women. Oh, right, when I came back, when I bailed you out of prison. Yeah? I was grateful then and I'm grateful now. Don't mean I have to do everything you tell me for the rest of my life. I told you, all the time I was away, I never stopped thinking about you. Me and Sarah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I meant it. You're all I've got. You mean everything to me. Emotional blackmail. How predictable. Look, I don't tell you often enough, right? You're my girl. You always will be. If you've got a problem, you just got to talk to me. I've got a problem because of you. What, what me, Michael? Yeah. Crack open the cans. It's what you wanted, isn't it? What is? I've binned him. Never want to see him again. Happy now? What are you two staring at? Katie! Katie, wait up! I've got to get back to work, Ryan. I've got these for you. What for? Um, it works in the movies, doesn't it? <laughs> How cheesy is that, Ryan? Yeah, I know. Um, OK, you want cheese? You got it. Katie Sugden, what do I have to do to get you to go out with me tonight? <laughs> go on, love, tell him. <laughs> Does she look that shallow? Are they real orchids? Yes. Look, Katie, I, I will hold one of these flowers in my teeth. I will, I will take my clothes off and I will dance up and down this village street starkers if that's what it takes. Stop it. Fine, OK. <laughs> Let him get on with it. Yeah, I said that. <laughs> oh. Just tell me that I've been a graceless prat and that I don't deserve the pleasure of your company tonight. You have been a graceless prat and you don't deserve me full stop. Go for a drink with me tonight. I'll think about it. Is that a yes? I will text you, OK? OK. <laughs> oh, go on, love. What's worse that can happen? Uh, Brian coming back to have some coffee in Katie's case. <laughs> <laughs> what I won't give for a man to be saying that to me. <laughs> go on, admit it. You've missed me. Well, Will has, because he hasn't had anyone to play computer games with. Yeah, well, time. I'm very glad you're back. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you had a good time, dude. Yeah, well, you wouldn't believe, mate. <laughs> Are you free for a pint later? Oh, I can't. I've got plans. Sorry. So do I. How about dinner at home tonight? And you can give us an edited version of what you've been up to. <clears throat> well, as long as you've got your little tantrum out your system. Well, look, if you mean do I feel more positive about my nearest and dearest, then... Well, then the answer's maybe. <laughs> so, both of you dinner tonight? Yeah, go on, you know you want to. I'll talk to Diane. Yes! Um, wish me luck. Um, the way he's looking at you, Katie, I don't think you're gonna need it. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. <clears throat> wow, you, you look beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> what can I get you? I've uh, served the corner table and put some wine on ice for you. Have you arranged all this? There's no pressure. I mean, if you want to go somewhere else, that's fine. No, no, no. Not when you've gone to all this trouble. With flowers and table. We'll stay right here. doing now? 
Um, she's laughing, tossing her hair around. <laughs> That's a definite sign of flirtation. What, pulling your hair? Not pulling your hair. But I know. All right, I've been behaving more like Edna Birch recently. I thought you'd be flattered. Yes, and I should have been. It's just... The last thing I wanted to do was jump straight into bed. I wanted you to take me seriously. I do. I do. I take you, I take you very seriously. OK. <clears throat> Maybe you can explain this, then. Found in my flowers. Debbie, I love you so much. I can't live without you. Sorry, 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 M. Ah. Flowers weren't for me, were they? Technically, no. But that doesn't mean that I wouldn't have got you flowers like those if I'd have thought about it. <laughs> Ryan! I'm really sorry. I'm a complete idiot, aren't I? Um, you <laughs> have my permission to storm off and tell your friends what a complete prat I am and that I've led you up the garden path. Ryan. That I... I don't actually care that you didn't buy these for me. They're gorgeous. I'm glad you like them. And also, next time I buy you flowers, I'll know what to get you, won't I? <laughs> Be a next time. Well, yeah, I mean, that depends on whether you let me stay or send me packing. I think I'd have to have a pretty good reason to do that, don't you? Mm. Engine trouble did it, I think, last time. <sighs> yeah, the sight of you stomping off in those ridiculous heels. <sighs> Ryan, don't, please. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. I'm kind of glad you did it in a way. What, because now you know I've got a temper? <laughs> well, yeah, and it showed that you were bothered enough about me to make me wait. It's kind of a compliment, yeah, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, kind of. <sighs> um, so what time are your friends back? Not for ages.